So uh, what's got me started in development was years ago, I mean, many years ago, I won't say how many. Um, I've just always loved technology. I love the just uh, figuring things out, trying to learn new, new ways of doing things. Um, uh, but it, what I really want to focus on is kind of what's kept me going and something I tell all the staff on my teams are, we've picked a profession that changes. You can't just sit back and year after year just rely on the same knowledge you have. And I think that might work well with your company because I stress to my teams, they got to keep learning. IT keeps learning. You look at the number of languages we have today at this conference we're at, you've got languages today that didn't exist five years ago. And people have to keep learning, have to keep, and that's what I tell my team. And that's the passion I have. I love learning, I love doing, even though I, I manage teams, I go home at night and work on code, try to learn things. And uh, we're just, our field is just ever changing and you have to keep up. Uh, and I think that's one of the things that excites me about it is it never gets boring. There's always something new to learn. Okay. And how do you um, encourage your teams to learn? So I, one thing I really stress to my team is, you know, as, as, as a manager, as a company, we're, we're there to help and assist. But I tell people they own their own career. Mm -hmm. They've got to... They have to have that passion. If, if and they've got to, there's websites out there. There's there's company like yours. There's all kinds of places where you can go find and learn about new technology, old technology, whatever it is that you're that you're that you're trying to learn. But I try to make it very clear, the onus is on them. Well, we're here to help. I'm here to coach. I'm here to guide. And and Turner will have classes. People will have classes. But uh, really, the individual has to want to learn and has to find those different avenues that work for them. Uh, whether it's continuing education, or whether it's focus classes, whether it's an online class, something that they can do to just go out and play and, and just work with code. Uh, and what is your name and who do you work for? My name is Rich Anderson and I, I work for Turner Broadcasting here in Atlanta.